Good afternoon, everyone. Thanks for joining us. Uh, my name is Austin Knudsen. I'm the State Attorney General. With me today, I've got Montana Highway, Highway Patrol Colonel Steve Lavin, our Montana Division of Criminal Investigation Administrator Brian Lockerbie, Assistant Chief of Billings Police Neil Lawrence, and a number of legislators here. I'll take a second and introduce them. Representative Kerry Seekins Crow, Majority Leader Representative Sue Vinton, Senator Chris Fidel, Representative Sherry Esman, Representative Larry Brewster. Uh, thank them for joining us here today. <laughs> so we're here today to uh, talk about the governor's budget and kind of our, our uh, goals moving forward for the legislature out of the, for the Montana Department of Justice. So as Attorney General, I put the focus of the Department of Justice back where it belongs, and that is on fighting crime and keeping Montanans safe. In my first few weeks in office, we've cut desk jobs in Helena to get additional narcotics agents on the streets. We spearheaded a grant program that came out of the Montana legislature that helped us get two dozen drug detecting canines out on the streets in Montana, all across the state. We added a statewide drug intelligence officer who assists local law enforcement and public health agencies. And working with the governor and with the city of Billings in Yellowstone County, we put additional drug and crime investigators on the streets right here at Billings because we know Yellowstone County is facing uh, a major impact of these drugs. It's made a difference, but we still have a lot of work to do. Drugs, and especially fentanyl, are causing a crisis in Montana that's resulting in a major crime problem. We are seeing violent crime across all categories continue to spike in Montana. Uh, these drugs are coming from the wide open southern border. There's no question about that. We know where these illicit drugs are coming from. We know where the fentanyl is coming from. We know where the methamphetamine is coming from. These are cartel drugs that are pouring across the southern border, which is largely unsecured. Uh,